Hey guys, welcome back to my channel and good morning from London. I don't know what that was, but I don't know if you've noticed whenever I get to a new city, I greet you like in the native language. And since the native language here is English, I had to put on a really bad accent for you. But anyways, I just arrived at my hotel here in uh, London. We are staying at the Curtin Hotel in Curtin Road in Shoreditch. Shoreditch is one of my favorite parts of London. I haven't been to London in four years, guys. This is one of my favorite cities in the world. So I'm super excited to be back here. I'm here with Lux. We are here for the Ambassadors Summit. So I cannot wait for the next four or five days. And Asia is also going to be here. It's amazing that we actually booked on the same trip because that like never happens. So I'm really excited she gets here later this afternoon. And I'm rambling because I haven't slept and I've been flying all night. So I'm going to head to breakfast now. But yeah, I can't wait to take you guys along with me. So I came to join the other girls from South Africa. Can we just take a moment for Palestra's travel? Did you travel in this? Did you fly in this? Yes. Guys! <laughs> can we just do the matching Nikes and if... Oh, I can't. Don't forget. I cannot. So I was going to nap. And then I heard all these babes are going shopping and then they went my nap. So we are on our way to Primark now because that's what you do when you first get to London. You go there and you go and buy a bunch of things that you don't need and you see Oxford Street at the same time. I am wearing a dress from Nala Cape Town. It's like two or three years old already. Modest by Asia cropped denim jacket and my Air Force one. <laughs> Hi people, I'm hungry. What are you I eating? actually don't know what I'm supposed to be doing today and I keep telling Akila that I can't make content today. Look how brown you are. I was in Santorini. Girl had a private villa and whatnot, so everything is dead. She's like she's like a I'll let you you're like imagine a, that first. <laughs> you're like a roasted chicken. I am like a roasted ah. chicken. Anyways, this is what we're having. We're having Mexican. We are at Oaxaca. Hi guys, it is day two here in London. Well, actually, it's technically day one of our Lux activities. We are on our way to somewhere where we're gonna do some Luxy activities. That's what we're gonna do. And everyone in the bus, we all have to wear like purple or shades of purple. It's really cute. Can you see everyone's purple from here? I don't know. So, what are we doing now? But anyways, yeah, I'll keep you guys posted. But just know that it's day one and we're doing. Bye, I love you, be safe. No. No. <laughs> My name is Juliana, I'm from Brazil. Isn't she beautiful? I can't deal. We're just chilling outside here at the Ace Hotel, taking pictures, exploring the product, of course and just getting to know each other. It's really fun. Everyone here is so nice. I meet wonderful girls from Jeddah in the Middle East, from Brazil. 
I get to share the few Portuguese phrases I know, <laughs> which is really just about shopping and food, the two essentials in life. So guys, tell us what happened. So I got into a Tell us, actually, you tell us. We had a fight that we don't really remember. Okay, I don't remember very well. I, I do. Yeah. I mean, vaguely. But we don't remember. No so we, we blocked each other on Instagram. <laughs> and we're trying to figure out how to fucking unblock okay. each other. We're like, but we're not getting it because it's a long day. Yeah. And we're going to I know. It's the babes from Africa. Over here we have Tuli Bay. Of course, you've already met Crystal and Palissa. And this is Jemima from Nigeria. She's basically Miss Nigeria. Look at her. Okay, so we're all good up. Everybody's all good up in the little lab coat. We've got our little glasses, our little gloves, and basically we're gonna be making our own fragrances today. Um, so we're doing top notes, the heart, the base, the whole shebang. Uh, they're gonna be helping us put our fragrances together, and then later we're making candles, and they're going to inject our unique fragrances into the candle. So we were first asked to think about how we feel before creating a fragrance because fragrance is about emotion. So me personally, I'm feeling excited, I'm feeling happy to be here. So I want something that's really gonna capture that. Let's see if I get it right. We just came back from a lunch break and now we are going to be creating candles using the scent we created. So this is the scent I created and then this over here is our setup. And basically we're gonna go and pick out some petals that accompany the scent as well. And we're also gonna be gluing that inside this jar over here and starting our candle process. This is so cute. Came to my room and Lux gifted us with this adorable little basket and some baby's breath. How cute. Uh, so basically, Asia and I came to Primark because we've been given an assignment where we have to shop for six items and it's actually for you guys and we've been given a budget. And all of that, along with the candle that we made today, it's all going in a little box and we're doing giveaways with it. And it has to be iconically London, non-perishable, gives followers a boost of confidence and yeah, we have to stick to the budget. So we only have like 25 minutes left to do this. And we were thinking, you know, what's super iconically London and really special to us. And both of us are complete Harry Potter freaks. So we're gonna see if we can get something here that whether you're a Harry Potter fan or not, We'll give you a boost of confidence, let's see. So we are finally back at the hotel. I'm in Asia's room right now actually. We're having uh, room service. How cute is our little setup? And basically, I hope I didn't get you in there now, okay. Just <laughs> cut it. <laughs> so, we're just laughing about a potential hair reveal. So that's yeah, we're laughing yeah. about a potential hair reveal. But <laughs> we're it's not like going to happen. Gender reveal. <laughs> yeah, so I'm not showing her. You can see her hands. Show them your hands. She's really here. Eating my broccoli. <laughs> <laughs> so basically, we are, well, she's prepping her gift for the little thing that we're doing that we have to give away to our followers. And I'm just here eating, planning content, trying to see if there's a way we can go to Harry Potter World. Oh my god, I'm so excited. 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 Oh my god, I'm so excited
We have such an agenda tonight. We actually have like a serious agenda. Oh. Look at my cute new Harry Potter pajamas. Oh, so cute. <laughs> Good morning, guys. It is day day three in London, but day two on the like brand summit. Uh, we just came back to the Ace Hotel. We are doing a uh, floral inspired or infused inspired or infused jewelry today. Hello. This is Khalia. She's so cute. so cute. She comes at you with the shoulder every time. I love it. So today we are serving you with some springtime fresh realness. Modest version. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. What's the name of this? Oxford Botanical Garden. We just came to Oxford Botanical Garden. Wearing matching shades, show the people, show the people. I'm so so car sick, I can't function. Yeah, same. So, we're at Oxford Botanical Gardens and we're gonna learn more about like botanical garden things. No, but all seriousness, I'm super excited to be here. My husband has turned me into a plant person. So, I gotta represent the fam. I've gotta go and convey all this knowledge back home. It's called Victoria Amazonica, which is the larger of the two. I know you can see. Yeah. Guys, look at Palesa's look. Palesa's casual garden sleigh. Look at this. Show us. I mean, this girl doesn't come to play, hey? Can I just show you this girl's commitment? She's basically sitting in like a bee infested area. Judging? No. Judging me. Yeah. Just came back to my room and found this on my bed. How cute. It's basically a little gown and a loofah and my first bottle of the Lux Botanicals. Oh, it's Jasmine. Jasmine always reminds me of my wedding day. That's special. Um, yeah, so basically I'm supposed to take a little bath and try out the new product. I'm so excited. Um, I'm really happy because I basically have a bit of an evening off and I'm so tired. So I'm going to try and get him to bed early tonight. Let's see if that actually happens. Having the best time though. Having the absolute best time. Um, the brand is just so cool. They're just treating us so well. They're spoiling us. The girls are also awesome. Um, I'm especially just loving the Brazilian girls. They just like crept into my heart. They're so, so cute and so, so fun and so friendly and everything. And I'm going to miss everyone when we all go back to our cities hopefully we'll all meet again in another city it's happened before as you know yeah i'm gonna order some food and try and get my life together morning guys it is day three of the Lux brand summit and day four in london and we are at facebook today What we are doing right now is we are going to put together our beauty and beyond kit. Of course, Rebecca Cole showed us some really cool ways to do that. Let's see if I can actually remember them. Um, but anyway, I want to show you guys what's going to be in the box. We have a little girl power photo frame for keeping of you and your girls. Or I mean, you could just keep it on your desk as a reminder that you are a boss. Um, I'm sorry, I know I don't speak as if you're all going to get one. <laughs> Then to remind my followers of the magic within. Don't let the bubbles get you down. Just don't do it. Just don't do it. We're magic. We're magic. We're magic. Yes. 
Rimmel Provocative Lips. This is one of my favorite, one of my favorite liquid lipstick formulas, and it's super cheap as well. Um, the reds are usually my favorite, but I can only get three in red and then three in pink. So three of you will get red. And Anyway, and then of course, this is my necklace that I made yesterday. Yes. I really love these things. And then, a very sentimental candle. Guys, I put so many emotions into this. It does smell really nice as soon as you opened it. You're gonna know how I felt as a baby. I'm 22 years old for the last time I came to that. <laughs> And you're gonna feel it all when you listen. <laughs> when you listen to your candle. When you <laughs> <laughs> Morning guys, happy Friday. So yesterday my camera died after the Facebook and Instagram visit, but it was really, really cool. And for the rest of the night, I just went with Asia and the Brazilian girls. We went to have dinner. So it's actually my last day here in London. Um, I fly out tonight at about 9.30. So I am gonna go and uh, shoot with two sisters. They're photographers. Actually, one's a photographer, one's a journalist, but they've got like a creative team going. Their names are Noor and uh, Z. So I think it's Noor who's going to shoot me. So we're going to go shoot some content over by Tower Bridge and a bunch of other places, I think. I just realized that while I was here, I didn't get like some really cute, you know, like touristy type of things. So as much as I'd much rather sleep in a uh, glorious bed behind me, I gotta do what I gotta do, you know, work is work. So I'll do that and then hopefully tire myself out and shoot, I mean, not shoot, sleep on the plane. Where are we? <laughs> Waterloo, can South we call this Waterloo? Bank. We're in South Bank. We're in South Bank, close to London I and close to what's the stuff parliament and all of that and big ben but big ben is injured <laughs> so this is noor from noor and z she is a photographer she has her own blog and um we are shooting i wanted some touristy stuff and we're trying to get that and make that happen without and all the tourists but it's impossible without all the tourists without getting caught in the rain with me reaching my flight on time later yeah. with so many conditions but we got some good shots so far. i think so i think the ones with the buses are best i know i still love those ones Hey guys, so I'm chilling at the lounge here at Heathrow Airport and I am headed for my flight too and I'm going back home. So that brings us to the end of today's vlog. I'm really interested to see how the footage is going to turn out because every single day I was so tired but so high on life and I just think that my sentences were just not making sense. Tell me in the comment section if you agree. Don't <laughs> Um, but yeah, that brings me to the end of this London vlog. I hope you enjoyed coming along on another trip with me. Um, thanks so much for watching and I'll see you guys next time.